The ninety eighth annual exhibition features two artists, Sue Johnson of Maryland and Pam Longobardi of Georgia, whose work overlaps thematically. Evolutionary Drift explores relationships between humans and nature. Johnson and Longobardi comment on characteristics of our society and subsequent transformative effects on the environment. Both artists are interested in what happens at specific intersections of culture and nature. They reveal these intersections with Longobardi's work rooted in fact and Johnson's images seeming to reside in fiction. Both artists encourage us to question our cultural trajectory and, with both serious and satirical voices, invite us to contemplate the notion of evolution drifting off course. Both artists take a somewhat scientific approach, in Johnson's words, making art as a response to what you've discovered and collected. Longobardi travels to distant shores collecting what is essentially runoff from our consumer society. As part of her ongoing drifters project, she chooses objects from mountains of colorful plastic doodads, mostly unrecognizable from their original form, broken down and modified by time and currents. These she assembles into mosaic-type installations, like an entomologist preserving specimens. Her 2007 photographs entitled Drifters and Messages in Bottles provide visual context for her source material. Another source material for Longobardi is defunct currency, which she uses to create collages, alluding to issues of value and worth in a dramatically changing world. In Event Horizon from 2006, doves surround a ring of fire which encompasses a group of minuscule figures cut from paper currency from Afghanistan, China, Costa Rica, Dubai, Myanmar, and Zambia. Longobardi explains, the ring of fire was an allusion to global warming, and the tiny people inside from all the different countries was to suggest that all humans are in it together. Her installation, 1614 to 1914, A Disappearance of Wings, is a somber tribute combining small portraits of extinct birds with antique coffin handles. On each portrait, Longobardi has pounded into copper the scientific name of each bird and the year it became extinct. Details of angel wings from Renaissance paintings fade in and out, appearing and disappearing on an earth-like orb next to the portraits. The angel wings, symbolic of both death and innocence, pulsate like heartbeats. <laughs> 